do you still seek out mentors to learn new things? Oh, absolutely. Um, you know, success is levels. Success is perspective, right? And there's always somebody that's making more money than you. There's always somebody that's smarter than you, that their business is bigger, more successful. Uh, so number one, you have to define what you believe is success. And you gotta be comfortable with that because keeping up with other people is like uh, tiresome, right? Like it's just emotionally unnecessary. Um, but uh, I do have big goals and I'm a continual learner. And so I have a lot of people that I depend on that I can have a cup of coffee. And we were talking about Chris Hively, a uh, very successful entrepreneur in the Raleigh area. And maybe once or twice a year, uh, Chris, who's uh, done tremendously well, I just can't overstate it, but he'll have a cup of coffee with me and just let me ask him questions. And for somebody that is super successful to be willing to do that, it's one of the reasons I try to do that for others. And what I've found is the more successful people are, the more open they are. It's the people that are faking it, that like it's, I'm so busy, all that stuff. Uh, people that are really successful uh, realize that they didn't do it all by themselves. And they're usually open to giving a hand up to other dreamers um, because that give back to them is personal. Um, and, uh, but I absolutely do. And I have mentors for different things, right? Uh, my friends and mentors and people that I'm on boards with, they have different talents. And so some are deeply technical. So when I'm looking at a technical company or I'm looking at an idea, I'll, I'll go to them. Some are wonderful with people and leadership and mentorship, right? And I met with a, day, a gentleman the other day that is more on the spiritual side of things that I can talk with about things and faith and family and different things. And so uh, I do seek people out. Um, one of the things I've found is I've grown as an entrepreneur and matured as an individual is I've gotten really comfortable with not having to have all the answers. Uh, in my younger self, I would get frustrated if I didn't have the answer. And now I know that my job is just to seek the answer. And that's so uh, much more comforting, right? Because when you're seeking the answer now, it's exploratory, it's curious, it's fun. Uh, and I don't have that unnecessary pressure that I have to be the smartest person in the room every day. And it's, it's, a, it's an unnecessary pressure that I no longer have. So I love the mentors that I have and I appreciate them very much.